Hey YouTube, what's up? Hey, we're gonna break down an AV8B Harrier and uh, build this for you guys. We'll break it down, snap it together from the bottom to the top, and present you with a nice, easy to follow build guide for an AV8B Harrier style starship in Starfield. So let me break it on down and I'll be right with you for the build. All right, before you start building this ship, you're gonna wanna pick up your specialty parts. From New Homestead, you're gonna grab six Slayton Aerospace SA4330 engines. From Teo Astroneering on Neon City, you're gonna pick up your shipbed 200 landing bay. And from Deimos Star Yard, you're gonna grab a 100 DP Slim Docker. That's all the parts you're gonna need. You will need six of these engines. Everything else is common parts available at your Landing pad with shipbuilder at your outpost. So once you grab your specialty parts, make your way over to your outpost. And we're gonna start off by dropping down a Teo Slim uh, 200 shipbed landing bay. Connected to that is a Teo Companionway one by one bottom B variant. And then next to that, we have a Teo Control Station two by one bottom B variant. And next, you'll connect a, actually, you're going to connect your Teo braking engine onto the front of that. And then you'll bring in a Nova Cowling 2L, and you'll place it here. And then you're just going to duplicate it and flip it. And then that's how you're going to get one on the bottom there. <clears throat> All righty. Next, bring in a pinpoint landing gear four. And then just place that right here. Duplicate it. Flip it. Bring one to the other side. Duplicate it. Change the variant and put one here. Duplicate that. Flip it to the other side. Duplicate that. Move it here. Duplicate it. Flip it. Connect it to the other side, duplicate, change the variant to the to the aft, and then duplicate that, flip it, and connect it right there. All right, next we're going to go ahead and uh, bring in a Deimos hole A and place it just to the left of the one-by-one -one companionway. Right here is where I'm going to merge my reactor, my grab drive, and my shield into one spot to, to hide them. So I'm going to duplicate um, three Deimos holes right here. I'm going to put my shield on my companion way. And then I'm going to bring in my grab drive, which is the J52 Gamma grab drive. And I'm just going to connect that onto the top ones. I'm going to select two of these and duplicate them and just bring them over here. Now I'm going to select my grab drive and the bottom Deimos hole and duplicate it down and delete this extra part. And what that did is drop my grab drive onto my shield so I could delete this one. And now we're going to bring our reactor. And we need to duplicate this down two times. So select your reactor and the Deimos hole and duplicate it down. And select your Deimos hole and your bottom reactor and duplicate those down. And now you can delete all these extra parts. And now we have reactor, grab drive, and shield all merged in, into one spot. Next, grab a Teo companionway one by one. You know what? Hold on. I lied. I actually want these to drop into my companionway. So what we're going to do is select your grab drive and your Deimos hole and duplicate down and then delete the grab drive from here and then select the Deimos hole and the reactor and duplicate them down and delete your reactor. So it should end up looking like that. Then you can bring out a Teo one by one top B companionway and select that and duplicate that down. And basically, it's going to clip a, a grab drive and a reactor where we have our ladder, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't really affect anything, ultimately. 
Uh, go ahead and grab your your slim docker real quickly and just place it at the bottom of your companion ways. Just right there. Okay, next bring out a tail two by one bottom or a two by one top B and connect that right here. I'm using another control station. This is so that I have maximum crew. I have two control stations. I don't really care about anything else besides my crew count. Okay, next bring out an M50 Ulysses HE3 tank and connect that right here. Make sure it's dropped down right into there, into your landing gear, and then flip it twice and cancel. And then go ahead and duplicate that. Whoops. And then flip it, bring it to the other side, flip it twice and cancel. Next, bring out a Nova Cowling 1L and change the variant to the PM. Snap that in place right here, flip it twice and cancel. And then go ahead and duplicate that again. Snap it in right here, change the variant to the PA and cancel. Okay, go ahead and duplicate the SM again and flip it, attach it to the other side, flip it twice, and cancel. Okay, you can go ahead and duplicate that, move it here, change the variant to the SA. Make sure you actually snap it on the grid before you snap it. Put it into place, flip it twice, and cancel. Duplicate parts have to be put onto the map before you can snap them. So. All right. <clears throat> Next, you can grab a Teo Cowling, snap it in a place right here, flip it twice, and cancel. Then, then you're going to bring it. Oh, sorry, guys. This is a specialty part. You might not be able to add this right now if you didn't already buy it. So it's a Hope Tech Companionway Fuselage A. If you don't have this, I apologize. You're going to need that part. Uh, if you don't have it, just grab, grab another. Um, well, actually, if you don't have it, you could add it in later. But for right now, just duplicate your 2 by one have up. And then put your engine, put your cockpit here. We're using an Armstrong 10. Put your cockpit onto that and then duplicate your cockpit down. Okay, now delete this extra one. And then you basically just won't have this part till after you go buy it. Once you go and buy it, or if you have it right now, <clears throat> just place it right here and duplicate it down. Okay, so you're gonna have that look. So you can pick it up later and just drop it in later. Just head over to um, to Hope Town and and purchase that fuselage A, and then just drop it on. You could build the ship without it. You'll just build it like this for right now. <clears throat> Okay, next, bring out a Nova Cowling, flip it, and change the variant to a BM. And then place it on top of your landing bay. And then duplicate that and change the variant to the BA. That's bottom aft and bottom mid, by the way. All right, let's see, now we're gonna do our wings. So what I want you to do is duplicate these two Deimos hole A's and what the heck? Uh, set them right there on top of the Nova Cowling BM. Go ahead and duplicate one forward. 
and duplicate these to this to both sides okay so we're looking at that we have seven of them here we could delete these two now okay right, first thing we're gonna do is bring in a demos bracer and then duplicate it and then duplicate both of those and place them on the other side now uh, duplicate both of these over one more and then one more okay just like that all right bring in a Stroud cap a and just connect it right here to the back part Duplicate it and flip it and put one on the other side. Flip it three times and then duplicate this. Oops, sorry. Duplicate this one and connect it right here. Flip it four times and cancel. Do that again. One, two, three, four. Cancel. Same thing over here. Duplicate it. Snap it into place, flip it four times and cancel. Repeat that one more time. All right, so now you have that look. Now duplicate all four of these up, and then you're going to flip them. So that they're so they have the flat edge on the outside. Three flips for those. One flip for these. Okay. And now you can duplicate those down at the bottom by selecting this bottom one here and duplicating. Okay. Now you can delete these top parts. And you should have a look like that. And now we want to bring in these parts, these bumpers. And they're basically going to sit inside here like that. So what we want to do is bring this forward. And then bring out a Deimos bumper, put it on there, and flip it. Okay, duplicate all three of these over to here. And then we're going to drop down these, all four bumpers, select a bottom hole, and duplicate down. And you can delete these extra parts. <clears throat> we don't need this anymore. All right, now you can move this one over here and move this one over here. And we're basically going to move these over one. So now you're done with this, you're done with this, you're done with this, you're done with this, 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 this. Done with all those. You really don't need any of those anymore. Let's duplicate one of those. All right, so now we're going to duplicate these down. So select your four bumpers. And this bottom demos hole and duplicate down. And now you can delete everything up here on top oh shoot we didn't put one right here sorry delete these end ones if you ended up with one on the end and what we want to do is uh, we need to bring this duplicate this over to here and here 
and then bring one up on top. So we need one in this in this position. Okay. And then now we can bring a Deimos bumper onto here and then flip one over here. So that part will drop down, okay? So let's select our Deimos bumpers and this and duplicate that down. All right, now you can delete all these upper pieces and all these Deimos holes. And now we have, we have that. Now you can bring a bring in a demo skeg B and attach it to the middle section, and then attach to that a skeg A. And you could duplicate both of those and just bring them to the other side of your ship. Okay. And now you want to bring in a Nova Cowling 2L. And you're going to place it right here, but flip it two times. Oh, where'd it go? Flip it twice. Oh, it's dropping down. Never mind. It doesn't like us. Grab yourself a Deimos hole A. And put that right there. Then snap this and flip it twice and cancel. Okay, now you can delete that. Then you're going to go ahead and duplicate this, change the variant and put it right here, and then duplicate this, change the variant and put it right there. Now grab a Stroud nose cap B. You're going to put that in place right here, flip it twice, and cancel. Now you could just temporarily move this Nova Cowling 2L off. And you're going to bring in a Deimos spine F and then flip it to the aft position. And so it's got this slope on the outside, basically. And then you're going to grab a SA4330 engine and flip one to this position. And then duplicate that and put one on this side. Okay, then duplicate this and flip it so it's opposite of the one at the bottom. So it's just opposite of this, like that. And then duplicate this and flip it to this side. Okay, so, you, so you're looking at it like that. Go ahead and bring this one down. No, you can't yet, sorry. Um, so let's bring in, now we're gonna bring in a Deimos hull A again, two of them. And we're gonna select both of these engines and duplicate them down. Oop. If they go up, that's fine. Just select them again. And duplicate down. Now they'll go down for you. Okay, so now we have two engines here and two engines on the outside. So we want to duplicate these. So just uh, go ahead and duplicate them down and then select them again and duplicate them up. And now we have six engines right there. Two here, two here, two here. Okay, next you could duplicate this spine F, put it on top of your 
engines. And then bring yourselves in a demo spine A and place it right here, and a demo spine D and place it right here. After that, you can just position in your Nova Cowling 2L and flip it twice and cancel. And that's the basic design of your Harrier. I didn't duplicate these, so let me, uh, I moved them instead of duplicating them. So that's your basic, that's the basic design of the ship. Okay, the only thing left is your weapons. Now, if y'all watched any of my videos, you already know what I'm going to do. I'm going to hide my weapons all into one spot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them right on top of my grab drive here. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm going to put them all right there. That'll be a lot easier. So what you're going to do is bring in a Deimos hole and put that right there. And then you're going to bring in an equipment plate. Put that right here. If you don't want to do this, by the way, there's plenty of spaces to put your weapons underneath. Um, I just like to hide mine. Um, now you can delete this Deimos hole and duplicate this down. Okay, now what we're going to do is put all these weapons onto one equipment mount, equipment plate, to save space and to use less parts. So what I'm using on this ship is MKE-9A auto gals guns, Mahler 160 auto cannon turrets, and Atli 280C missile launchers. So this is like a ballistics build ship. So this is a sh probably a ship that I used when I was uh, ranking up my ballistic skills. So go ahead and put your first uh, weapon down here and then duplicate a copy up to the top. We are going to need two Deimos hole A's. All right, once you have those, so we have one in position. We need two more down, so let's select our weapon and our Deimos hole and duplicate down, and then select our bottom hole and our weapon and duplicate down. Since these have a max power of four, I, I can only carry three of them. So I'm going to now delete one, and now I have three down here. That gives me my 12 weapon power. Next is going to be uh, Mahler Auto Cannons. These also have a weapon power of four, so I could use three of them. So let's duplicate three of these down. So there's one, two, three, And then my final weapon is going to be the MKE-9A auto gals gun. So I need, I, this is um, also max power four, so I could carry three. So let's duplicate three down. There's one. There's two. There's three. Now you could delete all these Deimos holes. Delete this top weapon and equipment plate. Grab your Nova Cowling, flip it twice, and lock it into place. Go ahead and assign your weapons. And let's check our errors. Can't reach cockpit from landing bay. Can't reach uh, cockpit from docker. Uh, okay, why not? There you go. Just select your parts and make sure they're snapped into place. And in my case, the cockpit wasn't snapped onto the, um, the, the hab down here. 
So that's it. Good to go. Everything's working. For me, what happened was my cockpit was snapped to my fuselage, but the fuselage isn't connected to anything. So you need to make sure your cockpit's snapped to the Teo 2x1 bottom tab down there. And that finalizes the AV-8B Harriet. Go ahead and uh, validate no errors in your logs. Your weapons are assigned. You can go ahead and give it a name. I called mine the AV-8B Harrier. You could give yours whatever name you'd like. And that's it, folks. If you like this video, consider giving me a thumbs up. Um, and don't forget to check the um, playlist on my page. This will be the 13th build on the playlist, and we're adding more every day. So you could just follow that playlist if you'd like. And that's going to cover it. Until next time, everybody, peace out.